I mean, uh, so uh, how to manage your um, partner members. Uh, very easy. Now we have a login form here on the right column. All right. So how do you create a member username? Uh, right now I get like a test one, which is called member. I'll show you how, how we change this. So in Joomla 1.5, you go in sites and use a manager. So um, here you got a partner member who is a registered um, registered user of your site. So let's say you want to create a partner member username for a specific organization called I don't know uh, MTA, right? <coughs> you click on New here. So name, uh, that's the name of the member, so I mean, you can call it whatever you like, like MTA member, for example. The username should be like username friendly, so all lowercase, so MTA member, for example. And email, I recommend you using like a dummy URL, like MTA at seminars for health.ca, for example. You will never use this one anyway. New password, um, so you type the password you want to give them. So uh, for this one, let's try like uh, 12345, 12345, all right? And group, you want it to be registered. So please select only registered. Be careful not to select anything else because they might have higher rights if you do that. Okay, so they should be unregistered. Then you click on save. And now you got a new uh, MTA member, which is registered uh, as a registered user of your site. Okay. So now you just have to tell your uh, members or your partners that they can sign in here, entering their username. So uh, MTA member, for example, and uh, password is one two three four five. Login. So this is like a general page, you can read it, you can change obviously the text, right? Just uh, put a sample text here, but you can change whatever you like. Um, and now they'll log in here, so you can see hi MT member, uh, and they can log out, right? <laughs> but now they are currently logged in. So they click here and they go on, uh, like for example, on this uh, courses that I have set up. You click on this so for now you don't see any difference the price still shows 495 when you click on register so you got the pre-populated field here so you can put whatever you like so B, 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 B. so I'm just uh, putting some dummy stuff in there um, here and click on registration confirmation and here you can see the discounts. So fifty dollars discounts. It's it's been applied, and the granted loan is four sixty eight. So pretty simple. So how do I like how do I apply this discount? Uh, it's very simple. When you go in uh, components, even bookings, events here, and you click on this one here. You got a tab called uh, discount setting. Uh, I just put ten percent for members. That's it. Right, so the only condition is that all the partners and all the members of your partners will have the same discount. You can have you can have like separate discount like five, ten, fifteen percent for different partners. They all have to have the, the same uh, discount. That's the only trick. So you, you you got to edit any events that you want to apply this this discount for. And just uh, enter the ten percent, basically. So, like any any event that you want to apply, just click on it, go in the discount setting, and just type ten here, and save. And that's it. All right. So, uh, pretty simple. Uh, give me a call if you have any question. Thank you.